Hello everyone, we are back here on our channel. Today we are going to do a very quick review about our Destono cover, which I am using from uh, uh, almost four to five years now, and uh, it held up great. Um, I will show you what I don't like about it, and but most things I love about it. The only reason this is coming off because today is a big day. Uh, today we are going to have a smart cap on it. Then a lot of over, other overland stuff is coming on. Uh, so we will we will get get to that a little later on. But today we will just do a quick review uh, so I can share my experience with everyone if uh, that can help everyone. And this is uh, the very famous uh, uh, the backflip Max 4 uh, tonneau cover. Um, and the reason I, I bought this. Uh, because I wanted something which is lockable and little more solid and uh, You can see like it is not easy to open it. Yeah, if someone wants to get in They will but it, it will not be kind of they can get in with a screwdriver or something. So the way it works is It has a uh, this uh, pull wire and uh, It is not uh, that the flimsy one or the cheap one. It's it's a good quality one and uh, you just pull it and it opens and we have uh, three of uh, those points here like then there is another wire you pull and there is a notch here and then it opens then it goes uh, all the way up here if you want to use the full track bed for the uh, high stuff if you're hauling something which is higher than uh, um, uh, the tono cover. Uh, the only thing which I don't like about this cover is uh, these inside, these flimsy or kind of uh, very flexible holders for these bars. These are for kind of when we are using the full track bed. When we are using the full track bed, then we uh, hold it here the it has a butterfly nut here which I lost somewhere because uh, on a bumpy road it get loose and then afterwards I was not able to find it but it's not a big deal you can get it from anywhere maybe Home Depot or any hardware store so that is the only thing which I don't like because it keeps hanging like this and I was afraid that it will break one day uh, but it never did it, it, it held up pretty well um, and other thing it has is uh, it has uh, both sides have uh, those uh, those drains because whatever water gets into this channel it got drained uh, through those uh, to the to the ground uh, so it does not uh, get collected in the in the truck bed but when we are when you are washing a truck and if you want to drain the water when you're washing it then it's better it's a good idea if you pull this out because it will be blocking off uh, uh, the drain uh, for the water which is already in the bed so if we get if you get some water in the bed you need to pull those out uh, to get this water out but uh, if you're using the toner cover whatever water gets into the channels uh, it got drained through those uh, uh, both drains that it's a perfect uh, toner cover which held up pretty well and um, I used it pretty hard and uh, I I had my stuff in this truck bed and packed up all to the top and then drove on the rough roads yeah it, it it was tough on the cover but still it held very well so that's all I can say about it the only thing only other thing I would like to mention that is uh, that is a uh, weather dependent like there is no uh, nothing much we can do about it if we look here this mechanism when it locks in because I live in a Vancouver area uh, in British Columbia Canada so it's very moist we get rain almost all, all year so what happens in the winter months when it's all moisture around in the environment and then all of a sudden uh, we got uh, the freezing temperatures like we don't get much but whenever uh, we get the freezing temperature the water in this uh, pull out is frozen inside when it's frozen inside this pole does not work and I can tell you that is really a pain 
because it's uh, sometimes you want to open your tonal cover. And the other thing what happens is, which will be kind of uh, for everyone who living in who who lives in the cold weather with some moisture, because when we close it, if the water in is in all those seals, all the all the areas right here. So then what happens after freezing happen, you are not able to open it. And because even you're not able to open your tailgate because it gets stuck uh, with, the, with the frozen water into the system. So that's all we need to be careful about, but you know, like the de-icer will work pretty well. Okay folks, uh, that's uh, pretty much about, uh, about this tono cover. I just wanted to share my experience before I take it off and uh, more videos are coming on our smart cap and free spirit uh, tent so if you have not subscribed uh, please do that and uh, we also share our travel adventures uh, look up our channel for our uh, like northern adventure to the arctic ocean and all that so have a good one keep exploring and uh, just explore with whatever resources you have good day guys